A perfect storm is brewing for Ontario's subsidized daycares. Full day kindergarten and cuts to subsidies are threatening to force daycares to close their doors and are causing parents to worry about the future. Heather Butcher, a mother of two children on subsidy, states how she is feeling about this. I'm terrified. Without subsidy, I got no childcare. I can't afford it. Federal subsidy money will expire on April 1st of this year, and the province does not seem set to pick up the bill. Helen Kiprios has been the director of Roywood Child Care for over 20 years, but she is not sure how much longer her daycare will last. I have a capacity of 49 kids, and out of my 49 children, the 30 is on subsidy. So that is going to be a disaster for my center. Or it's going to be a disaster for parents try to find the money. But how can they find the money if they couldn't survive before? Even with the full day kindergarten, Butcher said she would still have to pay for child care. What the board is trying to do is have daycare within the same classroom. So we have to pay $30 a day for my children to be taken care of before school, during lunch, and after school. And I can't afford that. That's why I depend on subsidy. Although many parents oppose the changes to childcare in this province, Kiprio says she will wait to see the effects before she passes judgment. Definitely we needed a change. Now, going to this change might be good. Time will tell. It's Tristan Carter, Observer Radio News, Toronto.